Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So I am back with a Walmart and a Mighty Dollar haul. So we're gonna actually do the Walmart items first and we'll talk about Mighty Dollar at the end. So I picked up the new relaxing um, Dove body wash. It has lavender, oil, and chamomile. So I picked that up, wanted to give that a try in the body wash. I haven't smelled anything from it. it. Smells pretty good, it smells just like lavender. So I wanted to try that out. Y'all know I've been talking about purse pouches and all that good stuff. So I did pick up one of these. Um, part of me feels like I had this at one point, but I don't know what I did with it, which is bad. But this is one of these uh, cosmetic bags. It's a canvas one. It says big lashes and big dreams. So I picked this up to put in my purse. I also picked up one of these clear ones. So this is by the Basics brand it says basics pure um i can't talk basics purse kit water resistant you can put bottles jewelry cosmetics cables and wires and toiletries in this bag so i wanted to pick this up to put some stuff in it um from my bag i also picked up two containers of the purell hand sanitizer in the energizing mint so this is the purell like spray sanitizer not spray but you know it comes out with this little pump thing so I picked up two of those great to have of course in your stash and then the last uh, thing from Walmart I did get some tank tops but I've already put them in the washing machine they had tank tops on sale they were marked down from I think like 750 to one something maybe 150 if I'm not mistaken so I got black blue and green but I've already washed those, so those are already in the laundry and folded. They had this Crayola Colors of Kindness um, set. So this was new to me, and I wanted to grab it, so I got it in both the color pencils and the crayons. So you get 12 color pencils, 24 crayons, and it says these 24 Crayola crayons are specially labeled with warm words to inspire smiles and happy thoughts. So... The colors do appear to be lighter though is the thing it's the main reason i picked it up and it kind of gives you an idea of the colors on the back of it and on the side of this so some of the colors include peace of mind which is a cool mint color hello sunshine which is yellow sky's the limit which is powder blue and a warm hug is oatmeal so that gives you an idea of some of those so if you want to pick those up for your little ones i think it's so cute i love the color palette so I wanted to grab those. All right, let's uh, get the Mighty Dollar item. All right, so if you all are not familiar with Mighty Dollar, um, it is a dollar store that we have here in the South. I'm in North Carolina. It is not everywhere. You can look up Mighty Dollar and see the nearby locations. Everything in there is a dollar. So um, they usually have like close to expired bakery type items on their sales rack and um, they are all a dollar of course. So I picked up some of these, what is this, um, Intamin's Little Bites, the party cake muffins. So for a dollar, that was a pretty good deal. I grabbed that and they had some decor pieces out. So I got one of these large pumpkins and it says 100% unfortunate souls on it. Cause might as well start decorating for Halloween at this point. I also picked up some of this micro gold. It says that it's new, dual action disinfected and antimicrobial. If I'm saying that right, it says that it's hospital grade, no harsh chemical odor, destroys 99.9% .9 of bacteria. So I picked that up. We'll see how that ends up being. And y'all, they had, um, they usually have like clothes out or um, overstock, I guess, of certain stores and. They had the Staples mouse pad. So I was excited to see that in like this purple glittery type color. It says optical, mouse friendly, non-skid rubber backing, and it is from Staples. So to get that for a dollar, yeah. All right, y'all. I also picked up one of these glow in the dark pumpkin things. So almost that time to start carving pumpkins. We don't see them in the stores just yet because we're still close to the beginning of August, but by the end of this month and in September, I'm hoping that we start seeing some pumpkins. I may not carve them just yet because once you cut into them, obviously they don't keep well. But 
at least have them, you know, and start, um, at least have the stuff so you can get yourself together. So, y'all, they had all these adorable sticker sheets. Now, y'all know I got two of this one because it's Stitch. It's Lilo and Stitch. You get over 200 stickers. They actually have Angel on the cover, which is very rare to see her on there. So, you get four sticker pads or sticker sheets in there. And a lot of the, the stickers are Angel and Stitch on there, which I love. I really, really love the fact that they're all in there. So you get a bunch of those stickers. Again, great for planners or journals. I'll show that more on my planner channel. So I got two of this one. And I got just one of the Minnie Mouse. I love Minnie Mouse. Over 200 stickers in there. Just an idea of what some of those stickers look like. Um, maybe stickers like that are a great idea to get your little ones into planning as well. Um, you know, not to stress them out or anything, but have them a little book that they can write down their assignments if they're into that kind of thing. Um, when I was little, I loved stuff like that. I've just always been drawn to stationery. I would literally, when I was little, beg my mama to go to, like, the school supply aisle and the stationery aisle. And it wouldn't even be back to school time. I just like to go and look at the stuff. So, if you have a little one that is into stuff like that, um, you can go to the dollar store and get them one of the, like, dollar planners to get some dollar stickers and just, like, encourage them to write or journal. doesn't have to be about their assignments, just anything to spark the creative juices for your little ones. So, I um, also got this Stitch, Disney Stitch Create a Sticker set. So, that's interesting. You're creating a sticker. So, there's backgrounds and you can put the sticker on there and you're, like, creating a scene, really. I know why it says create a sticker. It's really you creating a scene because the stickers are already there. So, that's something fun to do. Um, I also picked up some food items. They had a lot of the Wiley Wallaby um, licorice there. And I really love this brand. These don't feel the freshest though. They don't feel the softest. I really got them to show y'all. But typically, I probably wouldn't have got it. I'm probably still going to eat it. Let's be real. But... Um, I like them when they're pretty soft. So, this is the Blueberry Pomegranate. I have never tried this flavor before. So, I really wanted to get that. And, what is that? Is that a neighborhood alert? I get a lot of neighborhood alerts from my ring. Um, then there's the Wiley Wallaby Huckleberry. Of course, the purple stood out to me, but I'm sure the Huckleberry tasted fine. They had these Yoohoo Candy Bars. I had never seen these before. Uh, mini bars you get eight of them in there let me know if you've tried any of this crazy candy they had the twix cookies and cream don't believe that i've tried that either so i wanted to pick that up then they had these jolly rancher gummies these two don't feel that soft but i had never seen them before so i wanted to grab those and i believe this is the last thing from mighty dollar actually yeah, it is. I picked up the Brillo Basics Cleaning Wipes with Bleach. So these actually have bleach in them. Great for kitchen, bathroom, office, and more. So the Brillo Basics brand, they have a lot of stuff in the Mighty Dollar. I picked up some of their oven wipes before their sprays. The stuff works really good. Brillo Basics also is the company that has the soap pads that you use to clean your pots and pans. And then also um, sponges that we make it at the Dollar Tree. I think they create... Um, reusable gloves and stuff like that so they have a lot of good stuff there one more thing hold on i forgot i had put this bucket to the side i actually got this bucket at the mighty dollar it's got the little my little pony on there thought that'd be nice to put some candy in and then i got another pumpkin this one is purple and it says spooky so i probably have that somewhere here in my room um i got this scent it's a perfume rollerball by Love and Nature. It's called Hay Sugar. It's a concentrated perfume roller ball. I don't know what it's going to smell like. I didn't smell it in the store. Since we're here now, we are at home and this stuff has kind of been sitting here a while. So I feel comfortable, you know, opening it up and stuff. So this is what we're looking like. Okay. Smells pretty good. It smells like something my mom has hay sugar it's probably a knockoff or something y'all i have no idea but it smelled pretty good and it was sealed up nicely so there is that 
I also picked up some of these germ out wet wipes you get 18 pocket size wipes good for your purse again and then the last thing I picked up is this pumice stone always nice to have those on deck y'all know I need to go to the nail shop so bad I just need to find the time to actually go because my nails are looking bad I need to feel so bad and I need a pedicure but all that being said let me put this stuff back in here that is everything for my Walmart and my Mighty Dollar Haul. Thank you all so much for continuing to come back to my channel. I love and appreciate y'all so much. And I'll talk to you again in my next video.